here again. I've got another one of these uh, Cheapest Jack Knives on Amazon. I've modified this one. I've modified this one yeah. to escape from cuts. So I'm trying to make a jackknife that will escape from any cuff. I'm starting easy. Doing this one, aren't I? You are. <laughs> 37 seconds, man. Is that the whole video length? That's the whole video length. Fifty seconds. That's it. Yes, P model one hundred. Think about the cheapest jackknife. I'll show you what I've done to modify what it. modifications he's yes. done. I'll show you that now. So for these, the modification, <laughs> the modification. <laughs> if I can get my words out, I made to the jackknife. Are you recording? Did you know you were recording? You just jumped in there with the modifications. Oh. You just said, uh, back again, like you used to. Well, I'm back again. This is the modification that I made. That's bad. Happy. For which I basically cuts? just, uh, well, actually, I use this on a lot of things, but it gets you straight out of the ASPs, no problem. But I actually made it out of the snake rake. I basically took this, uh, filed off the snake bit because... She basically just chopped the end off. Yeah. So, so you I'm just made a pointy pokey thing. I'm, I'm unlikely to need a snake rake for escaping cuffs. So you just made it a pointy pokey thing? Yep. It's basically a, a straight pointy thing to stick in, lean back, twist to the side. That's the double lock off. Nice and easy. In at the top, follow the key way around. That's that one done. Nice and easy. Cheddar! And uh, if you have yellow poly SPs, doesn't matter which ones they are, it's not that different. Well, I think the plastic casing on these is a bit thicker, which makes it slightly more awkward. But there it is. Well, it's not that hard. But, yep, that's the modification. Just made a straight edge. Pokey thing. From the snake rake. Pokey thing. That's all from us. See you next time. Bye.